If you train jiu-jitsu, then you need to bulletproof your knees. If, maybe you don't if you're in your 20s, but if you're over 30, 40, 50, I'm 61, you need to bulletproof your knees. So, you know, I've been training for over 25 years. I have a lot of issues with my knees, but I keep them safe with this workout. So I'm gonna show you today the fastest way to bulletproof your knees. It's the easiest, it's the cheapest, and I would say it's the best. And the reason why it's the best way to do it is because you're gonna do it. So many times people ask me for workout suggestions, I give them information and they never follow through. So if you don't do the workout, it's useless. You can do a more elaborate workout than this. Sure, I'm sure you can find them, but this is super easy, super quick. So the idea is we want to work the muscles around our knees. So the first muscles we're going to work are the tibialis right here. So I got all of these exercises and these workouts from ATG, the knees over toes guy on YouTube. You can look them up, amazing programs. This is my down and dirty, quick version of what he's offering, okay? So to, to work the tibialis, we're just gonna put our back against the wall. We're gonna flex our quads, bend at the waist, and we'll just pull our toes up. And we're squeezing those muscles. This is the first thing we're gonna do. And you're gonna see how quick this workout is. I'm only gonna do one set for every muscle group because I'm lazy and I'm trying to get this done as quickly as possible. I think that's about 15, so I'm going to do about 10 more. And the further you, you bring your, your feet out, the harder it is. The closer your feet are to the wall, the easier it is. Awesome. Okay, now that we worked the tibialis, now we're going to work the calves. So I'm just going to turn face the wall. And with, with my knees bent, I'm gonna work my calves from here. So all it costs is a wall. If you can afford a wall, you can do this workout. If this is too easy, you can do them just one leg at a time. Awesome. So we've got the muscles of our lower leg. Now we get the muscles of our upper leg. So I'm going to show you something over here. So if you're really ambitious, you can get these monkey feet. These cost, I think it's like 79 bucks. And you can attach a dumbbell to these. Let me get it out. Yeah, so you attach a dumbbell. It's like a boot. Strap yourself in and you can do leg curls. Or you can just grab something like this, really inexpensive, and tie a dumbbell to your leg if you wanted. Or we're gonna go over here. You don't need any of that. All I'm gonna do is get some. Blood flow into my hamstring and some work on my hamstring. So I'm just going to do some curls with no weight at all. So you don't have to buy anything. I'm squeezing in that hamstring. Awesome. Okay, one more. So I got the handshakes. Now we're gonna do some work on our quads. So these are called reverse step up. Here's my 
down and dirty where you're doing it. I'm just gonna be on my foot here, I have some balance. I wanna touch my heel, so I have the weight basically in the ball of my foot over here. And I'm just gonna wreck these out. I have some balance and I really don't care if I, if I shortcut the rep a little bit. I don't really care about having this huge range of motion. I'm just trying to get some work in my quad here. Now, if your knees are sore, if this is too painful, then you can do a lower. This is six inches, you can do four inches. You could even do, I imagine you can even do them right from the ground here like this, put your foot out a little bit. It's gonna be easier than the six inch motion. But what I do is, if I don't have any weight like this, I do maybe at least 50 reps. I just try to pump it up like a bodybuilder and my knees feel so much better. Do just five more reps here. And then that's it. That probably took less than five minutes. And I got some work into my knees. My knees feel better. So you have no excuses. You can do at least this. You do a more elaborate workout if you want, but do at least this. Awesome. Thank you.